Annie Lederman now joins the long list of comedians openly trashing Chris D'Elia. So I'm going to play this, then give you my thoughts on it. This is from her YouTube channel. She just posted this. And uh, she did a little something on Instagram where she just posted a picture of her watching the Chris D'Elia problem documentary. But here she uh, wanted to talk about him on her show. So let's see what she had to say. I mean, maybe that's something you have to explore in yourself. But it's like when, okay, so like if Annie is in a social setting, say we're at the comedy store, and Annie wants to go from the front bar (laughs) to the back, which is like, you know, just on the other side of the building. It's through two doors. Yeah. Three doors, four doors. If Annie wants to do that. Four doors down. It's four doors down. You have to understand that it will take probably an hour to get back there because you see people, and this is to your benefit. It's not a bad thing. I, I got to read funny. the names on the wall. Sometimes funny. Delia's no, name's you're there not reading still. anything. You're... Delia's name's still there. I always stop. I see. I pour out a little Red Bull for Delia. Annie will talk to... Because the girls that he hooks up with can't have alcohol. <laughs> Allegedly. They can't have that either, I don't imagine. I think children are allowed to have this. I would. Well, not... not. If we were in high school right now, we'd be crushing Red Bulls. Yeah, but my mom would not be happy about it. <laughs> well, I don't think your mom would be happy about you hooking up with Chris D'Elia either. <laughs> <laughs> so, but Annie, what she does is she'll talk to every human being that uh. she encounters... I just love the fact that they're now just all openly taking shots at Chris D'Elia. All Chris D'Elia really has left now is Brendan Shaw, <laughs> which is so sad. And Eric Griffin on the Golden Hour podcast. I mean, my God, the new allegations. And this is how you know, like, they're all probably true, the new allegations. Because now everyone's just openly trashing the guy. And the fact that he admitted to going to rehab. So this is still an ongoing thing with Delia. Like I said, my personal thoughts. If he's doing this with grown women, I could not care less. But at the underage, then it is a problem. I don't know. Like I said, I don't know the age laws in California. But I just find it hilarious Everyone is just openly trashing him. Let me know your thoughts in the comments.